Well, the first feeling uh, always when you go back into um, a set that uh, you've worked on before, same director, same same DP, same first assistant, the same crew, same actors, you're just going back into a comfort zone. That's what that feels like. So from then on, it's just, okay, here we are, home again. Let's just have fun. I got more and more intense as the three shows have gone on. <laughs> um, but I, I, I love that. I love, I love doing intense. And what, what it is for me is, is that, I mean, this is a, a blockbuster stunts, you know, special effects. And usually the people in those movies are ciphers, you know. They, they, you get to see some people wandering about, but you're waiting for the next stunt and the next stunt. Here, Christopher Nolan, the writer, director, is a, is brilliant because he wrote real characters and really great dialogue and great scenes, which is why I did it. Because I wasn't going to. When he when he came to my door and, one Sunday morning and he had this script, he said, "I'm doing Batman. I want you to play the butler." I said, "I want to read it." You know, I said, "I'm not going to stand there so coming to the movie every, every 20 minutes saying dinner is served. Would you like coffee?" You know, I, I want something a bit more meaty than that, and I really got it, <laughs> especially in this one. Yeah. It just got better and better. Got better, yeah. It, it, yeah. Uh, it, it s starts off, um, what do you want from me, boss? You know, I'm here for you. Uh, second time out, I, mean, I, 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 I get it. And the third time out, it's shorthand. Do it. I remember, it's sort of, he's, he's a supreme example of, of what uh, uh, the John Houston. I was working with John Houston once, and I, I said to John, I said, you never give me any direction. And he said, you get paid a great deal of money to do this, Michael. You don't need me to <laughs> tell you what to do. And this is exactly, without saying it, is how Christopher, he reminds me of Houston. And the other way he reminds me of Houston is I said to John, I said, what, what's, it, what's, what's the art of direction? He said, casting. And Christopher casts like a dream. If you look at everyone, right through like to the most recent, Anne Hathaway is Catwoman. It just fit the part. It just yeah. fit. It just you know, fits. You know, like, he's an amazing also director. All the pieces that fit. Yeah, right. and he's he's just got his feet pr footprints in the, in the in the in, in the Chinese, Chinese, Chinese theater, which is an yeah. incredible honor you get at the end of your life. And he's forty one, and he's just started. That shows you how well he's doing. Right. I got it a couple of years ago, but I'm seventy nine. You actually expected to get it, you know? Yeah. I, mean, you, you, I got it. I don't know how many years ago, and I didn't expect to get it. Yeah. Oh yeah, I, I oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think I think, I think uh, ending. this ending was to put them on a, an emotional roller coaster. Yeah, oh, oh, oh yeah, fanning themselves. I'm looking forward to seeing it with. I only saw with it on my own. Yeah. I want to see it. We're going to see it with an audience in IMAX. I'm looking forward to that.